Hi you guys, welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, my name's Lauren. It is Friday night and I think I'm gonna be filming a few days in my life vlog because I actually have plans tonight. I am going to dinner with my two best friends, Taylor and Maya. We're going to a place called The Osprey and it's in Baldwin Park. You've probably seen this area in my vlogs so many times. I walk there to get coffee. I constantly drive through there. I grocery shop in there. There's tons of restaurants little coffee shops, there's an F45 in there, tons of homes, apartments, all that stuff. It's probably one of my favorite, favorite areas. So we're going to a place called the Osprey. I've never been there before and it's a seafood restaurant. I'm really excited to go. I've been literally dying to go there. So. <laughs> up eating breakfast and cleaning up I've been sitting here all morning waiting for my Bahamas vlog to upload I was like beating myself up over this vlog because it took me a really long time to edit and when I got back home I was like getting back into the swing of work I was like cleaning doing a ton of laundry and I wasn't like focused on editing this vlog I was starting to edit it this week and it just took me so long to edit. It was like over 200 clips and even though the clips were like small, it still is a lot to like go through and like pull. And then I was trying to find a bunch of songs that fit like travel and beachy and just like good vibes and calm. I don't know how to describe it. So I was just trying to find music and that just takes so long. I almost every like few weeks need to dedicate like a full day or at least like three to four hours of going through new music because it really is time consuming and it takes a while to find like good songs that fit videos so it just took me a really long time to edit it and it's finally done and I was beating myself up over it because this was like the first week in a whole entire year that I missed posting a video and I don't know why I'm so hard on myself when it comes to stuff like that, but I just am. Um, I like to set goals for myself and like I set a goal to post a video like every week. I was just beating myself up over like not posting and I just like realized like it's totally okay to take one week off in a full year to not post like a video on time. So I'm waiting for that to post. I am about to change. Christian and I are going to play golf and I think I'm I don't have golf clubs or anything I did as a kid and growing up so I'm going to just sit on the golf cart and watch him oh Christian's calling me he's probably downstairs that was him he is downstairs so I need to quickly change because he's waiting on me in the car and then we're gonna go play some golf and I think we're getting together with Taylor and Maya again tonight like a whole little group of us and we're gonna like go out and like grab some drinks and stuff so that's the plan for today I really need to um edit a video like a full video today and tomorrow which i don't think i'm gonna have any time today so i'm gonna have to dedicate the whole entire day tomorrow to editing this video because i actually have to submit it to a brand tomorrow so i don't know why i did this to myself and like procrastinated on stuff like this but i did so and you guys would have already seen it and it's like i just felt so lucky when this brand reached out to me and wanted to work with me and sponsor a video. I just thought it was such a big deal. So I just feel, I just feel really lucky and super grateful. And I'm grateful for you guys that support me and watch my stuff and send me so many kind messages. It literally means the world to me. So I just feel really lucky and really grateful um, for all these opportunities that are coming my way and um, stuff like that. So I'm going to get ready. We're going to go to the golf course. This is what my dad prepared me for. This is what he forced me to do as a kid is learn the game of golf, be on the golf team, take golf lessons. This is what my dad prepped me for. 
my future boyfriend, future husband was gonna take me golfing one day. And he was like, you need to learn how to play golf. You need to know the game so you understand. And so that way he can take you. It's, it's happening. He, he said it, it's here, I'm ready. I'm laughing. <laughs> Okay, it's a lot later. I'm about to make a little coffee to kind of give me a little bit of energy because we're gonna go grab some drinks with friends and I feel like I'm really tired from being like outside in the heat playing golf. We were there for four hours. I didn't play, but like being out there was a lot. And I feel like I need something to give me some energy. So I haven't tried this before, but I like keeping little coffees like this in the fridge because i feel like for days like this it's easier to grab this and i feel like it's almost not as strong as having another double shot of espresso sometimes that's too much for me to have four shots of espresso in a day so i feel like just having a little bit of cold brew with milk or like keeping cold little cold brews in the fridge just help for days like this and it's not like too much um coffee Okay, I'm gonna drink this and then I'm gonna start getting ready for dinner because we're not dinner drinks because we're leaving in like an hour Okay, just change for tonight and I'm wearing my new skims fits everybody Top and I'm so excited to wear it, but I'm not wearing a bra with it because you can see Anything that you put underneath it, but I think it's so cute so comfortable So I'm excited. I don't think it's in stock, but if it is I'll link it. It's in the khaki color. next day I'm doing a ton of laundry and cleaning up right now and I'm about to sit down and start editing that video to submit to a brand today that's on the agenda for today I really need to get to editing this video and um, when I get myself organized for the work week it's gonna be a four-day work week because I am actually going to Austin Texas next weekend so so crazy i never take trips like this i never do like trips that are super close to each other heck i don't even really take trips in general so i'm just really excited to go and take a trip um i probably need to put together some stuff for that too so i don't have to like worry about it after work but i'm doing a bunch of laundry so i'll probably put together like a few things for that and since i took a carry-on to the bahamas with me i think i'm just gonna take a carry-on and not worry about checking a bag because i feel like that trip kind of made me realize like look you can pack in a carry-on let's try and like do it so i'm gonna try and pack in a carry-on and yeah i've never been to austin texas so i'm really excited to go and i'll obviously be vlogging and i'll be taking you guys along so definitely subscribe so you don't miss that video it will definitely be coming next after this one but yeah Anyways, um, I'm gonna get to editing this video and doing laundry, unloading the dishwasher, all the fun stuff. And I need to wash my makeup brushes too. Okay, I'm 
making a liquid IV and sorry my head's cut off. I don't want to get out my tripod for this, but I'm just making a liquid IV and I got one of these Stanley cups and I bought it off of Mercari, which is kind of like a Poshmark. I didn't buy it off the Stanley cup website because they sell out so quick. But um, this was the one that I found that was closest to the price that they sell on their site. I really wanted a white one, but all of the white ones were going for like 80 <laughs> to like a hundred dollars everywhere I found them and they were on eBay too but I don't like super trust eBay I don't know so I went with my second pick but I got it in this tan color but I really wanted it in white so bad but this is fine I like it because of the handle and it does fit in a cup holder but mainly for the handle feature I really don't think that it keeps ice in my cup that long as a yeti so i'm not like super i'm not like really understanding the hype behind it so i'm gonna go to target now but just wanted to share because i feel like these are all over tiktok and i just don't understand the hype behind them Okay, it's a lot later. I went to Publix and Target and CVS. I mainly went to Target to get this. My friend Maya recommends this and I think it will be good for those days that I want some color on my face but I don't wanna wear makeup like a CC cream or a foundation. So I'm excited about this. I'll keep you guys updated. And I just picked up more. I'm gonna get my nails done too this week. They're really grown out. Um, it's almost been three weeks since I had them on. And I feel like after like the week and a half mark, I want them ripped off because they're just so grown out. I don't want anyone to stare at my nails for too long. I just picked up some little mini stuff. I don't know what it is about um, the men's body care when I travel. I just get men's deodorant and men's um, body wash because I didn't like any of the women's stuff. So I just picked up this. And then um, I've been like on the hunt for <laughs> A good deodorant and Christian got this deodorant and I tried it and it works really well and I just don't buy antiperspirant I usually just buy deodorant but it's been so hot this summer that I've just been sweating all the time and it's bad and nothing works and last night I wore that skims top and I was worried that if I started sweating you'd obviously see it through the shirt because it's very thin and it's green and this held up and it was humid last night. It was rainy. I mean, it's Florida heat. So I went and picked that up as well. Highly recommend. It's really good. And then um, picked up some poppies from Publix. Last week they were two for four, but they weren't doing that sale anymore. So I just picked up four um, of the orange. And these are just really great for work. I bring them with me to work and they satisfy that almost... Like you want something after lunch in between dinner and I eat a snack but I want like a drink and water and tea just don't always cut it so I've been bringing these to work and it's perfect and then needed some more liquid aminos I'm gonna do the Asian meal prep I'm gonna actually start prepping that now because I was gonna do it tomorrow but that didn't make sense because we're leaving out of town on Friday so we need the four days of meal prep from Monday through Thursday and I also picked up some granola. It was actually buy one, get one free. And that literally never happens. And Purely Elizabeth is one of my favorite granola brands and it has really good ingredients. All the flavors are really good. So I highly recommend. And it's also on the pricier side for granola. It's like seven or eight bucks for this bag. So I picked up the vanilla chocolate chip, which is my absolute favorite. And then the original is really good too. There was a lot of sales going on at Publix today, so I was like buying a few more things that I didn't necessarily need. When this pasta sauce goes on sale, you just have to pick it up. So it was like a few dollars off. So I got the bolognese one, it's really good. And then I also got this, we've never tried this, so I don't know if Christian's gonna even like it, but I got the spicy marinara sauce and it sounded really good. So I picked up both of those and then some other stuff. Just wanted to share the little grocery haul. I'm like really tired. 
I just finished putting the bed sheets. I washed them today. I just finished putting them on the bed. So I'm so excited to shower and then get into clean bed sheets. There's nothing better than going to bed on a Sunday night with clean, fresh bed sheets. So I'm gonna shower. Um, I can't wait to get my nails done this week. I'm actually gonna get them done again, which I never do. I haven't had nails on this long in a really long time. And in fact, like getting them done a second time after I get them done, <laughs> unheard of. I think I'm gonna do like a royal blue, which is like one of my favorite colors, and then get the same shape, but you'll see them in the next vlog. And I wanted to pack some stuff today. Didn't end up getting to it, so I'm gonna have to do it after work. I also need to deep clean the apartment before we go out of town because I'm a nutcase and I have to deep clean the apartment before we go out of town. So that way we can come home to a nice clean apartment. Ooh, I'm gonna do that now. I'm gonna take my uh, sleep gummies. Well, I've been taking these together every single night and wow, I feel like my body is finally like catching up on sleep. I've been taking these for a while, but I stopped taking them. And then I recently started taking these a few months ago and then I just started taking them together and I feel like I get in such a good deep sleep, which is hard for me. So I take these about 30 minutes before I go to bed and they just do wonders. And I have a coupon code with Golly. I forget what it is, but I'll put it on the screen. I'll also link it down below, highly recommend. The one thing that I like about this is that it has melatonin in it and I don't react well to melatonin. It gets me up at night. I'm like tossing and turning um, throughout the night. And this one is the only one that really, really works. It also has lemon balm in it, which helps calm the central nervous system and ashwagandha is also really good at calming relaxing like de-stressing so i think the combo is just really good i feel like i get really good sleep and then i wake up and i don't feel tired so highly recommend i'm gonna take these and then i'm gonna get in the shower okay i just took the sleep gummies another good thing about them is that they taste good too so they're not like gross to take, they're actually really good. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you subscribe because the next video will be the Austin, Texas vlog. So stay tuned, I'm so excited. It's kind of weird that I'm traveling so soon after just getting back from a trip, but stay tuned for that vlog. It's gonna be a fun trip. I've never been, Christian's never been. It's gonna be so fun. So definitely subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys when we are on our way to Austin, Texas. Bye guys. Thank you.